This video shows you how to start an advertising campaign. You can advertise on other websites that use the ad services of Google AdWords to create an ad campaign on YouTube. You need to plan your ad campaign. Create a video ad. Sign up for an AdWords account. And then create an ad campaign. So, we are going to watch about the how to put ads on YouTube. Method 1. Planning a YouTube ad campaign. First is decide on a goal. Before you begin an ad campaign on YouTube or otherwise. First you need to decide on a goal for the ad campaign. While setting up your ad campaign, AdWords will ask you about the goal of your campaign. Do you want to increase your brand awareness? Do you want to increase? Step 2. Decide on a location. AdWords lets you target specific areas. What areas are you capable of doing business in? Are you running a local business? Or can you do business anywhere? Step 3. Decide on a target demographic. AdWords lets you target different age groups and genders, as well as different interests and lifestyles. Are you appealing to the general public? Or does your product appeal to a specific demographic? Do you want to reach a specific age group or gender? Step 4. Choose some keywords. Ads on YouTube appear in two places. They can appear before or during a video, or they can appear in the search results. To make sure your video is targeting the right people, you words users can search to display your video ad. Step 5. Decide on the duration of your ad campaign. Before you begin an ad campaign, you need to decide how long it's going to run. Is it an ongoing campaign that will run indefinitely? Is it a seasonal campaign? Are you trying to capitalize on a popular trend? Step 6. Decide on a budget. Budget should include cost of video production as well as the cost of advertising. Are you advertising exclusively on YouTube? Or are you advertising in other places like Facebook? Or traditional media? How much do you want to spend on advertising on each? Step 7 Film a video advertisement YouTube requires that skippable video ads be between 12 seconds to 6 minutes in length. You can either hire a professional production company. Or you can film it yourself if you have the equipment needed to film a professional video. Finally, upload your video to YouTube. Before you can use a video as an advertisement on YouTube, you need to upload it to your YouTube account. You should upload the video to a professional YouTube account, rather than a personal account. Method 2. Setting up an AdWords account. First is go to https colon slash slash adwords.google.com slash in a web browser and sign in. If you are not signed in, Click, sign in, in the upper right corner and sign in with the email address and password. Associated with your Google account. You can use any web browser on PC or Mac. Step 2. Click start now. It's the green button below the header that says, get your ad on Google today. Step 3. Type your business email and website and click continue. There are two lines on the first setup page. Use the top line to type your business email. The second line is for your website. Click when you are done. Step 4. Type your budget and click save. The next step in the setup process is to set up your first campaign. The first box allows you to set your budget per day. Click the blue button that says, save, when you are done. Step 5. Select a location and click save. You can click the radial button to select the country where you reside. Click, let me choose, and type a city, state, or zip code. Click the blue button that says, save, when you are done. Step 6. Select a network type. There are two types of networks. Search network is for Google searches, and display network displays ads in websites. Click the blue button that says, save, when you are done. Step 7. Type keywords and click save. To select keywords, either click the suggested keywords in the list, or type a keyword in the bar below the list and click. When you have selected all the keywords you wish to select, click the blue, save, button at the bottom of the box. Step 8. Set a bid and click save. Your bid is how much you are willing to pay to get your ad seen. You can select to have AdWords set your bid automatically, or enter a bid manually. Step 9. Type the text ad and click save. There are four lines for your text ad. The first line is for your website. The second and third line are for two separate headlines. The last box for a brief description for your ad. Step 10. Click save and continue. It, the blue button at the bottom of the page. This button takes you to the payment part of the setup process. Finally, type your payment and contact information. The final page of the setup process requires you to type your business information. Click, finish and create ad, when you are finished. You can now access the AdWords control panel.
Method 3. Create a YouTube ad campaign. First is go to https colon slash slash adwords.google.com slash in a web browser and sign in. After you have created an AdWords account using the steps above, you can access the control panel when you log into AdWords using your Google email and password. Step 2 click go to and type new campaign. It's in the upper right corner of the AdWords control panel. Type new campaign in the search bar. This displays a list of pages. Step 3 click the video button. It's next to an icon with a video camera in the button. The video option is for engaging viewer on YouTube and other places on the web. Step 4 Select the goal of the campaign. There are four types of guided goals offered through AdWords. If you don't have a specific goal in mind, select, create a campaign without a goal. Step 5 Select a campaign subtype. Campaign subtypes vary depending on the goal you select. Campaign subtypes include the following. Website traffic brand awareness and reach, and, product brand and consideration. Step 6 Click Save and Continue. It's the blue button at the bottom of the page. This takes you to the campaign creation page. Step 7 Type a name for the campaign. There is a line at the top of the page labeled, Campaign Name. Use this line to type the name of your campaign. Step 8 Set a budget for your ad campaign. To set a budget, type a number in the line next to the dollar sign. Select, Daily or, campaign total, in the drop-down menu below, type, under, daily. You can also select a delivery method. Step 9. Select a start and end date. To select a specific start and end date, click, select a date, next to, start date, and, end date, then click the drop-down menu to select a date from the calendar. You can also select, as soon as ad is approved, under, start. Step 10. Select a network. There are two network types for YouTube. YouTube search results only displays the video in the search results on YouTube. This option does not display the ad before or during a YouTube video. Step 11. Select a language. Optional. It is set to all languages by default. You can leave it as the default or use the line to type the language your customers speak. Step 12. Select a location. You can click the radial button to select the country where you reside or click let me choose, and type a city, state, or zip code in the bar. Step 13. Select a bidding strategy. There are two types of bidding strategies for YouTube videos. Maximum CPM sets the maximum you are willing to pay per every thousand times your ad is shown. Step 14. Set the content filter. The content filter allows you to exclude what type of content you don't want your ad to be shown. Alongside. You can also opt out of embedded YouTube videos, live streaming, or games. Step 15. Select devices. There are two types of devices you can select. All devices displays the ad on any and all devices. Specific targeting for mobile devices allows you to target specific devices and operating systems. Step 16. Select frequency capping. Optional. This option allows you to limit the number of times an ad can appear to the same user. Step 17. Set an ad schedule. Optional. Setting an ad schedule allows you to control what hours your ad appears during the day. Step 18. Type the name of an ad group. You created an ad group as part of the AdWords account setup process. You can type the name of that ad group, or a different one. If you don't want to create a new ad group, click, Skip ad group. Step 19. Type the maximum bidding for your ad group. Depending on what you selected earlier in the setup process, you can select the maximum CVP or CPM. Step 20. Select your demographics. By default, all demographics are selected. If you wish to target a specific demographic, click the drop-down menu and check the demographic. S. You want to target. You can select demographics by gender, age group, parental status and household income. Step 21. Select a target audience. Audiences. Drop-down menu includes three sub-menus. In market audiences, includes categories such as apparel and accessories, autos and vehicles, baby and children's products, consumer electronics, education, dating services. Step 22. Select the content for your ad to display along with. There are three content types, keywords, topics, and placements. Click this drop-down menu and then type or paste your chosen keywords in the box. Labeled, keywords. Your keywords are the search terms that people type in the YouTube search to discover your 
Step 23 Copy and paste the video ad URL. You video ad must be uploaded to YouTube. Other video streaming formats are not allowed. There is a bar under the, the section labeled, Create your video ad. Use this bar to paste the URL. For your video ad. Step 24 Select a video ad format. There are four types of video ad formats. In stream ads, video discovery ads, bumper ads, and outstream ads. These ads appear before, after, and during a video. Step 25 Type a final URL and display URL. The final URL is that the web address users are taken to when they click on your ad. The display URLs are the web addresses users see in your ads display. If you have a vanity URL, you can type it in the display URL. Step 26 Upload an image optional. By default, YouTube will automatically generate an image from your video. Click, choose file, to browse and select an image to upload. Step 27 Type an ad name. The final bar at the bottom of the web page is where you type the name of your ad. Step 28 Click Save and Continue. It's the blue button at the bottom of the page. Click this button when you finish filling out the form. It takes you to the confirmation part of the process. Finally, review and click Continue to Campaign. Your ad campaign now will go through an approval process. This usually takes about a day. Review the information on the confirmation page. If everything is correct, click Continue to Campaign. We hope it is useful to you. Please subscribe to our channel to upskill yourself.